What is going on Lucid fans? Welcome back to Trending Stocks. Today I just wanted to quickly pop on and talk on what happened pre-market with Lucid. So I'll give you a quick summary of what that is and go over some other fun data points behind the scenes. But before I do, make sure you guys hit that thumbs up and subscribe. I always greatly appreciate that. And with that said though, let's get right to it. So this right here is a very good example of a gamma squeeze. So imagine if that rumor that's floating around of the PIF wanting to take Lucid private was very true. This is where you'd have a massive, massive short squeeze because gamma squeezes usually do just aid into a gamma squeeze. But of course, with there no real validation of that rumor. It's no real uh, kind of reasoning for anything to go up from here. So this is just market makers covering the options because for those of you that did tune into my live stream under my other channel, Financial Journey, I brought up the massive amount of calls that were being purchased, mostly from shorts as a hedge, but on Friday. And there was almost about 120,000 options that was exercised. Of course, this is where you do get this massive amount of spike. Not necessarily all of them were really covered by market makers, but at least some of them. This is why there's a massive amount of volume that is happening. So again, let me know your thoughts on that in the comments below. Based on the options activity today, it does seem like it is still continuing as far as the, the momentum as well. So again, it might be a little bit more of a further their gamma squeeze near the end of the week because keep in mind that's usually on Mondays that this is where gamma squeezes really factor everything in and whatever it might be but as far as what is being purchased today it does look like around the 13 1250 1350 15 as far as strike prices so that might be a good indication of potentially where things might be going it is completely blowing up as far as the number of transactions that is happening on both the secondary market and the dark pool. Market's been open roughly about two and a half hours, give or take, and there's almost more than roughly about 300 transactions under both. So this is the secondary market, which typical retail investors do trade on, and this is all the dark pool transactions. So nothing really that stands out, but keep in mind, a lot of these are just over 100,000, so no million dollar or anything like that today so far. And when it comes down to this one, it doesn't look like just one, 10 million on on the secondary market, which is very, very significant if you want to consider it that way. But keep in mind, I'm not a financial advisor, so do your own due diligence at the end of the day. I just wanted to quickly pop on and break down what actually happened this morning. If you guys have any other stocks that you are interested in for quick analysis or whatever it might be, let me know the tickers in the comments below. Definitely be very interested in doing that. If you haven't already, hit that thumbs up and subscribe. Always greatly appreciate that. And with that said, let's all make a lot of money on Lucid.